So, I just heard some tea. <laughs> like, no one's, like, here, and you're, like, <laughs> tea. <laughs> Zero people here. They're all on the Zoe's life. Um, I just, I just heard some tea, and I was, like, hold up, hold up, hold up. Apparently. Wait, Zoe's saying. No, 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 Apparently, I'm an alcoholic or something. She's literally never had a drink in her life, so... I don't know what alcohol tastes like. <laughs> kind of funny. Kind of really funny. Kind of really funny. Someone is very upset for some reason. And I think it just shows something. Guys, you know what? Guys, you know this what? This is Haley coming out to y'all. She's an alcoholic. I'm an alcoholic. Let's put her in rehab. Yeah, my parents don't have any alcohol in the house. I've never even gone somewhere, but I'm an alcoholic. Um, wow, well, crazy how oh that gosh. works. Guys, you know what? It's more tea. I'm her plug. <laughs> like, her Yeah, name. she gives oh me all the alcohol. Like, I'm also a druggie, too. Did y'all know so, that? She so. just did cocaine off my desk. Yeah, I did. Crazy, so, crazy how that works, I, right? Yeah, it's just so, it's so, so funny. It feels so great to lift this off my chest. Yeah. And to tell you guys that I'm an alcoholic. I think it's so good. According to, to Zoe Laverne. <laughs> you know, guys, I think she's really just trying to, like, let you all know that she's an alcoholic so that way you guys all feel better about going to your AA meetings. <laughs> Maybe you'll be Zoe there. You go off for a second. Go off for a second. I have a lot I could say. You have the mic. Hashtag Haley is an alcoholic. Hashtag. Oh my gosh, wait, don't take me to rehab. <laughs> she no, where's to my rehab. alcohol? Where's my whiskey? I need my rum. <laughs> I need it. Y'all hear some. Where's the cocaine? Y'all hear some. I have a lot I could say about Zoe. I, I could. Like, I really could. Like, I have so much. Hurry, the maid's say. coming. The maid's coming. Get up now. We gotta go now. <laughs> now we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go to our AA meeting, guys. <laughs> so. Should I expose? I don't think we can. I don't think I can, but just know, like, okay, just know, like, she has done so many wrong things, and just know, like, I'm, I'm not saying that she is. I, like, she, okay, I'm, like, I'm one who's saying it. Like, Haley doesn't have to say anything. I was there for all of it because. I was, like, on the phone the entire time, like, Zoe's the one who's in the wrong. Like, it's not, it's not Haley. Like, you know what? I just want y'all to think about some. Y'all know that picture? Just try to think. Who was there? Just think about that. Just let that sit in your head for a second. Just a thought. No, no, let it sit in your head. Just think. I wonder who it could be. Who was I, I wait, wait, wait. Who was I sharing rooms with? I don't remember who was I. Um, um. Maybe they can tell us. Y'all know? Do y'all know? Do y'all know? Just get, just give me, just give me, y'all know? Just give me an idea. Hmm? So, I think it's very dramatic <laughs> of you to come on the internet because I don't want to be friends with you anymore and then tell everyone I'm a freaking alcoholic? What on earth are you on? No. Literally. Or what are you not on? And that's not even all of it. Like, uh, you, you can all think about that. Let that sit in your head who you think it is. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't. I don't know who it is at all. But I'm sure we all can think of a name and know who it is. But just know it doesn't end there. There's so much. There's way more to the story. There's so much more. I don't, I don't even think they know who's dragging me around the lobby at Playlist when I was drugged. I don't even think they know who, did, who was doing that. I don't remember. I mean. <laughs> so. There's just, okay, just keep in mind that, like, from what you do know and, like, whatever side of the story you think is right, just know that there's so much that you don't know that doesn't happen on the fucking sidelines that my mom's watching this. I said. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. So. On this, okay, there's so much that you don't know that happened <laughs> that she just hasn't said, like. I don't know why you guys believe I'm a manipulator and a liar. She literally, okay, she sat there for months pretending to be Haley's friend. 
Yet she's the one who went behind her back. Like, it doesn't add up. It doesn't. Haley's literally never had a drink of alcohol in her life. She's not an alcoholic. I don't. I'm literally scared to drink alcohol. I'm a baby. I'm a literal baby. She literally was like 14, like less than six months ago. Yes. Like, you're right. Haley's an alcoholic at 14. So. <laughs> totally makes sense, right? I tried to keep it cool. I tried to write her, but she wants. No, seriously, for like the longest time, like she did, like I was here for like all of this. She didn't say anything just because she didn't want to cause drama. Yeah, but once you're gonna call me an alcoholic and make all these accusations, that's just enough, and it's time for you to be officially canceled. The fact that there's literally, and like the funny thing is, is she's not canceled yet. There's not even like aside from just this stuff, like there's so much. There's more. so much more. There's so much more. Like aside from Haley, have y'all seen her? Like, do y'all know the trauma? Like, why? Like, she's not like a good person. Like. She's so manipulative and rude, and, like, she cheated on Cody for... Multiple times. Multiple times. For what reasoning? And then she sits there being criticized for cheating on her boyfriend, and she's like, guys, like, I have feelings, too. Like... Okay, well, I have feelings, too, and I got PTSD because of you, so if you could just shut your mouth, I would really appreciate it, Zoe Laverne. No, it's just... It's whack. It's all whack. It's all freaking whack. So, yeah... Apparently, I'm an alcoholic, and y'all can support whoever you want to support, and I'm sorry if you support someone who is a... Hey, guys, um, do us all a favor. Be sure to donate to Haley's GoFundMe for her alcoholic I'll rehab. rehab my know. rehab. Y'all know she needs it. Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. So... Maybe we can go ahead and give the money to help Zoe, because she clearly yeah. needs the help. I think... Yeah, I think that would be better of us. You know. So that's it. That's work. it for tonight. Um, the fact that Zoe calls you. Oh, she called me problematic. Oh, but I hid for a month that I was drugged. But she. Oh, okay. Sorry for sticking up for myself. Everyone's gonna say, "Oh my gosh, Haley's so problematic for going on live." But don't you dare. See, okay, listen. There's like a difference between like. It, saying I'm problematic and saying I'm an alcoholic, that's a huge there's, difference. It's not like she's just coming on here, like, to be like, oh, here's my drama about Zoe. Like, Zoe's literally calling her an alcoholic when she's never even had a sip of alcohol in her life. So, I think it it reaches a point when you need to defend yourself and you, if you sit here and hide, like, so much information to, to protect someone else, yet they feel the need to go out and call you an alcoholic, then, like, yeah, maybe you should stick up for yourself because there's so much info that you don't even know about that, like... She's just such a bad person. And, like, Haley doesn't have to keep this all, like, under the rug and push it aside. Like, she could easily, like, have just come out with this sooner and cause all the drama she wanted to. But she wanted to keep the drama away. Yet Zoe's out here calling her an alcoholic for what? Because I didn't want to be friends with her anymore because of what she's done to me. Right, because you definitely want to be friends with someone who drugged you. That makes so much sense. Well, I'm going to go now. So... Love y'all. Love you guys the most. Um, please go to the GoFundMe so we can fund. It'll be linked the on the next slide.